What's up, everybody? Welcome to another box breakdown. Uh, today, uh, we've got three of the brand new Bowman 2024 Mega Boxes. Um, and here, we're going to have four packs of 10 cards. Um, you know, I like those less packs, more cards per pack. I always like that. Um, but the big thing in these is we're going to get two exclusive five card Chrome Mega Packs. So these are packs that only go into the Mega Boxes and they usually have the mojo designs on there. Um, possibility for autos out of those boxes. So, some cool stuff here. Um, I always love ripping up some uh, Bowman, Bowman Megas. Um, the back of the box doesn't say much of anything. Um, it's kind of just, uh, hey, there's, just some, there's some stuff in here, good luck. Um, on the side, you can see that we've got the base set, um, top 50, you know, 50-50, stuff that we've already known here. Um, but you know, we're looking for those mega refractor versions. Um, those are going to be what we're looking for in these boxes. So again, um, uh, these are, uh, $50, um, at, um, uh, nope, a little bit more than $50. I believe they're almost $60 at, uh, Walmart. Um, so we picked up three of these to give us a little bit of a sample size on what we can expect out of a Bowman mega box. So let's rip into these and see what we find. Hope you guys are doing good today. Uh, have you guys been opening up Bowman? Um, this, I have definitely um, opened my fair share of Bowman this year. Um, here we go. These are the two Mega Box packs that we're talking about. These are the exclusive. These are going to have five cards in each. Uh, so we'll put those up there and we will rip into our first pack of Bowman. And we've got started off with the Yamamoto rookie card, which is always good to see. So Austin Wells, uh, Verlander, Green, uh, Pete Crow Armstrong, who was, I saw some clips of him throwing at him uh, the other night in the game. Did not take very uh, kindly to that. All right, now we've got two Chrome here. Um, both prospects. So we'll keep those there. And then, well, you know, each pack is started with a good rookie. So we've got an Ellie De La Cruz rookie card there. Um, Christopher Morrell, Michael Harris, Corbin Carroll. And then we've got a Rafaela. And then a Ralphie Velazquez. A Kemp Alderman. And a Roman Anthony on our prospects. We got a Carson Wisenhunt and a Cole Young. There. Um, somebody asked me, um, how can you tell the difference between the um, prospects and the non prospects? So if you look on the cards, um, a prospect is going to have the team and then the player's name. Um, and then if you look at a vet and has the player's name and then the team, they're just kind of switched. It's kind of a subtle way of knowing um, what's a prospect card and what is a vet card. All right, so we've got an Enrique Jimenez as a paper first, and then a John Cruz paper first, and then we've got a Travis Honeyman, and then Tony Blanco Jr. and James Wood. one more pack here and then we'll kind of look at what these base um, packs we're going to give you and then we'll get into those mega box packs here we go so daniel susak and then vander hay arias chase davis and spencer jones okay so out of those four packs we got a lot of prospects um, lots of prospects there. Um, first, not a ton of first. We got one, two, three paper, four paper, and one chrome first. Um, and then rookies, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rookies uh, out of those boxes or out of those four packs. Um, but this is really what we're looking for. This is uh, what everybody's kind of chasing these mega boxes for are these packs. So we've got a Miles Naylor and you can, and we do have color in this one. So 
So we'll pull from the back here. So we got a Justin Crawford. I'm gonna set these separately just so we can see them. And then a, another Spencer Jones. And then Luis Baez. All right, so you wanna see a first here. Yankees first is nice, but it's not as an Aaron Judge. So this is, this is number two. 299. So number to 299, Aaron Judge. So we'll keep that there. And we got one more pack. So we got a Volpe. Volpe there. Looks like we do have another color here in this one. Uh, Mike Trout. And then we got a Junior Caminero, rookie. Take that, and then Anthony Volpe, and then we got a Braden Taylor uh, auto uh, for the race, and then we've got okay. So this that these always throw me off with that color at the top, but this is just the rookie of the year uh, favorites, Austin Wells. So we'll put that there. But hey, it's it's not it's not extremely easy to hit um, a a rookie an autograph out of those packs. Um, you know, you're talking two, two packs of five cards each in each box. So for us to hit a, uh, it's a prospect auto. Um, that, I'll take that for sure. Let's sleeve up our uh, Aaron Judge too here. So, so far, first box, not too shabby. Not too shabby. So let's get into the second one. See what this one. This one. Uh, this one was also a little damaged. You know, I can't leave those damaged boxes on the shelf. Um, nine times out of ten, it doesn't mean anything. But for that one, for that one, it makes it worth it. Ah, oh, every uh, every damaged box has hits in it. It's definitely not true. All right, Mason Wynn, Smith Shawyer. Heston Kershad, <clears throat> Kerstad, uh, Nick Lofton. So we're a little run of rookies there at the beginning. We've got Carrera. Um, and then we've got prospects Blake Mitchell. And then we've got our Robert Calaz on the first. Fernandez, prospect. Keishel and Cole Foster are our two chrome prospects there. Yeah, only two chrome in each pack. So you're only getting eight base chrome out of here um and I, I i imagine you can pull still pull color out of those um but it may not be quite as as plentiful as we've seen in like the blaster boxes which were just loaded with color all right so we've got a abraham nunez and then a cam collier prospect interested to see what Cam Collier does. There was a good bit of hype around him when he first came out. And as a lot of prospects do, it dies off for a while, and then when they get that call up or they do something big in the um, in the minors, their prices kind of come back up. I pull this guy in every single box, just about. Every time I sit down to open up some Bowman, Filippo Duterte shows up. Uh, Carlos Sanchez, Jet Williams, uh, Jared Cerna, and How You Lee. All right, a couple more here, and then we'll hit those mega box packs. So, Dominguez, rookie, Adley, Jose Rodriguez, rookie. There's an Acuna, man. Talk about another heartbreaking season for that kid. Uh, Fran Garcia, Homer Bush, then we got Daniel Susek and Daverson Gutierrez. All right, let's get into our mega box packs. So we got a Gunner. It's, it's always good to see Gunner Henderson. Doesn't like any color in this one. Yeah, no color here. So Gunner Henderson and. Got Adley, teammates right back to back. And then Jackson Holiday. Well, that's 
I guess if you're a Orioles fan, that was the pack for you right there. Uh, Sal Freelich and then a J-Rod. Man, I think some good names in that pack, that's for sure. Some good names for sure. Um, it's kind of crazy. All three of those guys uh, were right back to back to back of each other. That looks like another one of those Rookie of the Year ones. All right, so... Bimelec Ortiz, this is a uh, one of the one of the better guys to, to hit out of the pack, so that's great. We're gonna put him over here. Uh, we got Cooper Pratt, and then Everson Pereira, Andy Rodriguez, and then George Walkow. All right, so no color unfortunately in that box, but um, we've got one more. We've got one more, and uh, that goes to show you, right? It's not the damaged boxes. The damaged box did not hold the hits on that one. So we've got one more box here, and we're going to get into it. And we'll go a little bit quicker through these here. There's our rookies. So Carlos Correa. We've got a first of Carson Wisenhunt and Abraham Nunez, Hal Yu Lee, John Cruz Chrome, and a Brock Vandenberg. There we go. Uh, let's see. There's a Henry Davis rookie, Trey Turner, Jordan Walker, CJ Abrams. There's a Augustin Ramirez. Raylan Heredia, definitely getting a little bit more first. Uh, there's a Dylan Cruz base. As, as I was saying, we're seeing a little bit more um, first uh, out of these boxes here. Um, so, you know, I think that's actually the first um, Dylan Cruz base first that I pulled. And I, um, I opened a decent amount of blasters and I think that that was the first, I'm pretty sure that's the first base Dylan Cruz that I have pulled. So it's exciting. Let's see what else we got here. And those are, let's go back to our, there's our prospects. Our prospects are there. And then we got a first of Bryce Matthews and a Jose De Paula. All right, one more of our base packs. And then we've got our two mega box packs right after that. So, so Dominguez. Uh, Jose Rodriguez, rookie card, another Acuna, Brock Porter first, a Douglas Glaude first, uh, Brandenburg, there's a John Wimmer, and then Kevin Sim. Okay, Do a little mojo on our mojo packs here. Let's see what we can pull out of our Mega Box packs. So, looks like we do have some color on this one too. So, that's good. Um, we got Isaac here, Matt Shaw, and Antonio Anderson. And then, let's see, for the Phillies, Bryce Harper. And this is going to be numbered out of 250 as well. So Bryce Harper. So the two color that we got out of these boxes uh, were Vets, uh, unfortunately. Let's see, maybe this last one has something for us too. So it looks like Rookie of the Year. Um, we got a Miles Naylor first, Luis Baez, and then a Heston Kerstad, Rookie of the Year, Spencer Jones, and Justin Crawford, so not much in that last one there, so. Okay, so three Bowman Mega Boxes. Um, these are not cheap, not cheap. Um, uh, you know, we've got, it, it seems just really heavy on prospects in this, this uh, product, way more than, um, and when I say prospects, I mean non-first prospects. Uh, players that have already already had their Bowman first. Um, that's what it seems to be really heavy on. Um, at least these boxes were. Um, 
I'm just kind of separating out our first chromes from our paper chromes. So three boxes at uh, $60 a pop. So $180, we got one, two, three, four, five, six base Bowman first. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 paper Bowman first. Um, we did get a decent amount of rookies. Um, you know, that's really not what we're necessarily chasing out of this product. But it really comes down to um, the mega box packs and how you do there. Really, that's really what kind of makes or breaks this product. Um, and we did okay. We did, um, I wouldn't say great um, by any means. Um, that little run of big three in Baltimore um, was kind of fun, uh, but still, you know, not what we're looking for necessarily out of this product. So as far as rookies go, one, let's see, I've got my first mixed in here. Two, three, four, five. We got five rookies out of those. So that was 30 of these mojos, 30 cards. Let's see, we got some over here too. I'm all over the place. And then for first, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight eight first out of there so um we definitely got more of the mega box first than the regular base chrome first uh, we did get two colors one out of 250 and one out of 299 both vets dylan cruz and we did hit the Braden taylor um auto prospect auto so um you know if for me for my as far as i'm concerned um, I would stick with blasters for the price. Um, these boxes are expensive. Um, they're very much make it or break it on the, uh, the mega box exclusive packs, the two packs. And keep in mind, there's only 10 cards in a box. Um, so, you know, if you're really looking for it, $60 for 10 cards, I don't know, seems a, maybe a little high for me. Um, you know, the possibility is always there, um, but I would do some serious comps on seeing like, hey, where's Dylan Cruz on the Mojo Refractors? What is that price looking like? Um, you know, that was three. We didn't hit one. Uh, so, you know, there's, you know, there, there's obviously risk here. Um, but as far as uh, this product goes, um, I think I would stick with the blasters for me personally. Uh, but you guys let me know what you think. Um, is, uh, is this something you're going to go out and look for? Uh, are you going to find some Bowman Mega Boxes and, and, and open them up? Are you going to stash some? You never know. You know, maybe uh, one of these guys becomes the next superstar and, and one of these boxes unopened skyrockets in value. So, guys, uh, I really appreciate you watching the video. Hope you got a good um, kind of snapshot of what Bowman Mega Boxes look like this year. And um, if, you, if you enjoyed it, I'd love a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Let me know how it's going. And uh, if you really like the videos, hit that subscribe button so we can bring more of these videos to you. So, guys, I hope you have a great rest of your day, and we will catch you in the next one.